Cheers and welcome my friends, I'm Horatrak and we are playing Europa Universalis 4 together with the newest DLC, Rights of Man. We're playing on very hard difficulty and with Lucky Nation set to historical. Welcome back. We have our one army down here hired out to um, the Teutonic Order. Um, and I think I'm going to march them back again. Um, because yeah, we don't really want to lose any men. We're just getting ready to attack Bohemia over here. Just going to switch to the political map mode so that you can have a look at what uh, is transpiring. So Moscovy rented some of their men as um, uh, as condottieri to the Teutonic Order so that they can beat up Lithuania, which is part of the reason why, or to to the Livonian Order to stop Novgorod and Lithuania. So, which is part of the reason why they get beaten up so hard. Um, I wonder why they can rent out twenty nine thousand. That's a lot. I mean, I've seen bigger Condottieri stacks, but not many. Okay, we lost a bunch of truces. Truce with Saxony has entered. Frankfurt has entered into a military coalition. Alnhalt, Hamburg, uh, Saxony entered the coalition. That's all not very good. They might want to spring the trap on me. Ah, maybe not. We'll see about it. Humiliate rival against Saxony. I mean, I could try to beat up the coalition. I'm going to take a claim on Saxon. So that's done. The biggest problem um, is that Bohemia might enter the um, coalition, and that's something I I don't I do not want. So I have to sort of uh, keep them on a on the timer for this. We have to be weary that in three months we are uh, we have to. We have to end our Condottieri um, contract. So I'm going to take the claim for this. Um, which might sour our relations with Brandenburg. I hope not. Oh yeah, and they accept a peace. Uh, what did they take? Holy crap, these guys have been curtailed. And they took a bunch of land. I mean, they give this to Pomerania, but they took a lot of land out of the Holy Roman Empire. I cannot really accept that. Livonian Order is now the rival of Brandenburg. Okay, then they got peasant revolts. It's not looking too good for them. I'm gonna pull that guy back because I don't need any claims anymore. I don't need a claim on that one because because I don't plan on on taking it. I mean, I might, but it's not really a thing. Mm, Teutonic Order. Oh yeah, they have unlawful territory. They won't be able they won't be willing to do it. That's for certain. And it's gonna wreck our relations. Neumark. Not a member of the Empire is a Teutonic claim. Power of Bavarian Alliance compared to, to, to Teutonic. Really? You don't fear me. Who are your allies? Hungary, Livoning Order and Pomerania. I mean I got the Alliance of France, but I don't have enough favors to bring them to bear on them. I guess they are sort of reckoning that. I don't like it. I can still hurt them by doing this. We sort of um, have a mission to get up to a hundred relations. I'm gonna do that and then we're gonna... Then we're gonna end it and hit them with the claim. Because even if um, they don't uh, accept it, it still hurts them. It gives them revolt risk, more unrest and stuff. Uh, they will have difficulty controlling this. So that's definitely a consideration. Um, we do have the Diplo power to maybe go to a, a, the next level in tech, but I kind of want to hold on to it. Oh, and we have that. In spite of rigorous attempts to eradicate heresy, the population of some of our provinces are strongly attached to their faith and are still resisting conversion. I guess I gotta throw money at them. I don't like it. But what else can I do? So we're in July now. Brandenburg and peasants. Yeah, this didn't go well for Brandenburg. This ends in November. July, August.
gonna bring up my I'm gonna bring up my forts. Actually, what I gotta do is I gotta sort of march into these provinces that uh, Austria has claims on first. Yeah, okay. Oh, they had expected us to do more fighting. Our reputation has been tarnished and making new office will be difficult for 15 years. That's not good. That's not good, but oh well. We're still waiting for this. I want the 25 diplomatic power that I can get out of it. Let's bring this army over. Um, let's hope that Austria decides to fight first. I don't want them taking Moravia out of out of that uh, whole equation. Still Bosnia and Saxony. November 26. Oh no, it's still another year. Yeah, I. I saw that wrong. I read that wrong. Crap. Well, let's go down with the army maintenance again. <laughs> okay. Well, Condot Yeri are a no-go now. That's that's pretty bad. At least we might save some money. Come on, one more tick. Okay. That gave me five prestige. Restore the currency is the only thing that I can do. Um, inflation less than 5%. Yeah, that's not going to happen. I have to hold on to my admin power for now. Um, they're still fighting Novgorod. Demand, demand the unlawful territory. Not a member of the Empire. Power of Bavarian Alliance. Yeah, they don't they don't believe I can make good on my on my claims. They have annex and imperial principality. So they refused my demands. More local recruiting. I gain one base manpower in Würzburg. Our decision to ensure that local privileges will be honored has meant that peasants are keen to defend their villages. This in turn has the added benefit of people being less resentful about serving in our military. Good, I take it. We are um, at more than 50%, which is pretty good for us. We're not really um, that well uh, doing that well in conserving manpower. It's only less than a year. Damnation. It's less than a year um, for that war over here. Could go up in Diplotech, but I sort of have to hold on to my Diplo stuff because um, Bosnia and Saxony. I have to hold on to my Diplo pants to get the peace treaty I want. Let's recall that guy. Alsace joined the Trade League. Why do I have to say damnation? I don't care about that. Um, I still have the coalition. I still want want to get people out of the coalition, though. Improve relations over here. Um, improve relations with France. Mm, I mean, I could take a claim over here. These guys are fighting heretics. And Bohemia is fighting. Do we have internal peace otherwise? Yeah, we do. And we're still losing 0 0.09 Imperial Authority. That's bad. Uh, we, we renewed a loan. We lost the Diet Held. So we should be able to do a bunch of stuff over here with the nobility. Yeah, I can call the Diet, which increases their loyalty and their influence at the cost of prestige. And I can demand military support. I don't really need that. I do want the admin support though. Um, can I do anything that increases their influence? Yes, that uh, is a thing. Increase that by 10. Influence is 25 or greater. That is their control. Because I've seen other people take this for 100. Hmm. 
send an emissary to the Pope. This will give us 10 papal influence. No, I don't want that. Let's seek the support of the clergy. Yeah, that went up to 100. Now let's do that. The generous donation. Meh. I don't have the money for it. These guys, I'm going to call the diet. Which should grant me... Yeah, that grants me 100 military power. I'm not desperate for it, but I, I could use it. I mean, I could do a bunch of development with it. Mm, and I could go for centralization. That would give me that. But I sort of have to save my points. It's really hurting us that we have um, bad rulers. These guys aren't great. I mean, why not, right? Why not? Let's do it. And that only gives them influence. Uh, they would go up to 70, but it's not a problem. And we can have more leaders than that. Mm, I mean, we're not really in need of more leaders. But why not? Let's grant the generalship. What do we get? Oh yeah, he's pretty good in shock and maneuver. Why not? Why not? Okay. Yes, uh, we're just going to wait until we can declare the war. Mm, I'm going to go up in army maintenance right now. And make the forts active as well. Restore the currency. We're increasing with uh, these guys. Did they have to end their alliance with me? They didn't. Okay, I'm not going to call them into this war either. They're just too weak to fight anything. Took decision, passed conventicle act in Saxony. I don't like it. It's May. Oh yeah, and I need a free diplomat there. Let's call the guy back from France. We're renewing our loans. No longer renting out the first army to Teutonic Order. That's fine, I guess. Unhappiness among the peasantry. Conflicts in protest over taxes, landlord cruelty, expropriation, serfdom, and custom policies have become quite frequent. If they don't manage to solve the problem soon, the consequence could be dire. Gain 10 prestige, lose 10 stability, or lose some money. Guess it's got to be the money. I cannot lose the admin points for the stability. Uh, too good has agreed to share their maps of Egypt with France, who learned of nine provinces. Prestige has been transferred from France to Too Good. Okay. Renewed alone. Gained the trade protection. From, uh, Austria seems to be pirating. It's November 26. I have to declare war. September. I have to declare war before they join the coalition or I won't have much fun. Because I don't want to fight all of the coalition. Uh, Denmark gave Norway 75. That's a lot of money. Right there. I only have restore the currency. <laughs> it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. And the allies are still only Bosnia and Saxony. Truce with Bosnia expired. And rebels broke Brandenburg. I guess Brandenburg is not very prestigious at the moment. No, minus 64 prestige. <laughs> I don't care that they got taken down a notch. Yes, that's fine. I sort of care that um, the Teutonic Order took these provinces. I don't like that. Um, this is only a territorial core. Does not cause overextension, but will have a high level of autonomy, and the core will be lost if it is conquered. Okay. Um, yeah, we've got to declare war here. We've got to declare war right now. Mm, and the war goal is going to be Prague. I can call a lot of guys. Um, Saxony, who are your allies? Anhalt, Bohemia, Frankfurt, Hamburg. I sort of would like to make them a co-belligerent. But I wonder if that's going to trigger the coalition. I 
guess it will. I guess it will. I'm not gonna do it. I mean, I'm gonna take a big chunk out of um, Bohemia in any case, so it's not gonna be a problem. Um, Württemberg, we might not need you, but we're gonna call you nonetheless. We're gonna call Cologne, we're gonna call Austria, and we're gonna call Denmark. We're gonna, gonna call all these guys. And we're gonna do it like right now. Right now, let's move into Pugiovice. Let's move you over to Ostmark, to Moravia. Let's try to take as much as we can. Surprise, not surprised to hear that they honor their alliance. Okay, so they're all with me now. These guys are still marching down, which should allow me to take Morava without um, too many problems. Ostfriesland is hiring out some troops. Guess that's fine. Let's hope that they bring their troops down fairly quickly. Flanders, they tell us of new draperies. A new technique for fabric production have begun to emerge among the cloth workers of Flanders. The so-called new draperies are much thinner, lighter and cheaper than the thick woolens that used to be in demand. While demand is on the rise for these new products, their productions makes use of considerably less wool and as a result prices have been declining. So price of cloth increases, price of wool um, decreases. Okay then, it's fair enough. That's our, that's Johann Theodor the first from Wittelsbach, and that's our heir. Let's put our heir in charge. Switzerland has accepted an offer to hire a French army again. Are you at war? Yeah, Savoy, Austria, and Mantua. For what? What is that war about? Savoyard conquest of Novara. Okay, so Savoy called in their allies, which means Austria is not going to help me too much in this. Um, that's not good. I don't like it. Uh, Württemberg, why are you here? Yeah, they've been called. But why are they not um, blue? And we got Bohemian Separatists in Pilsen. That's not good. France declared war upon their new uh, their enemy, New England. Uh, England. What are they trying to conquer? London! French conquest of London! <laughs> Oh, that has 35 development. Holy crap. That's a lot of development th right there. Okay, we've got that. Let's move on to Prague. So that we can sort of keep these under, under lockdown. Yeah, we have a bunch more men than Bohemia. This shouldn't be a problem at all. No problem at all. Oh yeah, there are some troops fighting over there. It's, main, it's only a Danish group of... Uh, only a small Danish group. Bavaria is occupying Morava. Within the Bohemian fort in Vratislav's zone of control, so... Yeah, I guess I gotta siege that one down. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Taking another loan, because that's what we do. We really have to stop doing this, but um, gaining all these provinces should give us a better economical base. Brandenburg allied with Lithuania, Bavaria and saxe -Lauenburg. I really want to get into the great powers. I need that. I want it. So we're losing a bunch of men from sieging those um, things down. There is an army hired by Saxony. I think I'll leave a siege over here. Oh, and we managed to, to um, breach those walls. That's good. No, we only left we only left one cannon in here. That's not a good idea. That's kinda stupid. Um well, let's do this. Let's send these cannons in. Let's see how that goes. It should be fine. These guys are fighting. They're gonna take out that Wurntebergen army. I don't care too much though. 
Let's merge these and let's take out all those guys that we don't need. They tell us of felt hats. Um, I guess I gotta split that army as well. Just gonna take all these guys out into ads. That should be fine. I don't want to lose too many men to um, attrition. That's just not a thing that we can that we can do. But I do have enough leaders that I can give each of these armies a leader as well. Let's take these provinces while we're at it. So there are the 20,000 of Bohemia. As they're coming at us. I can still merge my troops. This is not looking too bad over here. I hope they'll join. And yeah, they're fighting those Saxon troops. Now we're nearly done with uh, sieging down that place. Nice. <laughs> That's going that's going really well and that one is uh, that one too. I'm not sure why. I'll pull these guys out again. Another Oh, Denmark have the Count's feud. Where among the possible options they went with support the new monarch. Okay, we won Vratislav, which is good. Um So we're done sieging that down. I think we're gonna go for Saxony. No. Um, bring you out. Yeah, that's our new general. 144. It's not too bad. Denmark is hiring out some troops from Moscovy. That's looking good. Um, now we're going to do the same trick as before. We're going to use our good siege leader to siege that one down. Um, we sort of um, might actually siege those provinces down as well. And I sort of want a separate piece out all of these guys. What's it, What about Bosnia? So nothing happening with Bosnia. Bohemia still has their army, but they are a paper, a paper tiger by now. I would like to um, separate piece out Saxony. That would be good. If I can do that. Let's move up. Um, Prague should fall any any second now. Let's get out of there again. They're moving on Leipzig. Will there be a battle? Yeah, there will. And they are not locked in yet. Yeah, I don't want them there. Let's leave a siege and let's siege that down as well. I don't want to give up any of these occupations because I might want to get something out of it. I think I'll, I'll break out Thuringia out of Saxony. That might happen. Um, let's leave a siege group. Let's get in there. And uh, we sort of could use these guys to take over Wittenberg. Might not be necessary though. Ah, oh, come on, Denmark. Anhalt. Uh, we're done improving with Anhalt. That's fine. Um, let's bring these guys out then. The Danish are probably gonna flip the occupation to us. So that's that's gonna be fine. That's looking good. Bavaria occupied Thuringen, so let's pull these troops out. No, go through our own lands, you fools. And we are occupying Leipzig as well. Oh, and now, now they think eh, it's not worth it to occupy it anymore. That that pisses me off. But oh well, let's go. We have five cannons in this one. So we should get the full siege bonus. Or has military tech already moved on? Yes, it has. So we now we need... No, 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 it hasn't. It hasn't yet. We won the Siege of Prague, though. So that's good. Let's bring these guys out. Um, and I think I'll send in my cannons to siege down Saxony faster. I will sort of take out these 2,000 men. And we don't want these to die. So we'll, we'll help them. Yeah, this war is this war is going really well, <laughs> I think. <laughs> if we don't get pulled into another war, we will be fine. Okay, they're gone. 
Um, will I be able to force them to change their religion? Force religion. They are too big. 144 war score. We're not quite there yet. <laughs> um, what would take... What would taking Saxony do to my aggressive expansion? It would piss a lot of people the hell off. But I guess I'm not getting on the good side of these guys um, anytime soon. So I might as well sort of ramble my way through it um, before we get into the religious war of the Reformation. I think that might be the way to go. Taking Saxony, maybe even taking, taking Wittenberg as well. Is that still an interest of Brandenburg? Uh, it's not vital anymore. They sort of have um, toned down their interests. They still want Neumark, and we might actually force the Teutonic Order to return that. Um, but yeah, so far things are going fairly well. The good thing is that our manpower hasn't um, drained severely yet. So we might be able to uh, get um, some good stuff out of this. Um, I mean, how much money do they have? 200. That's not amazing. How much money do these guys have? 769 so we might actually be very happy given more than they expect and will owe you one favor okay yeah that's that's kind of nice that it is showing me how many favors i get i will only get 200 out of this amount though um, so i guess my war participation is not very high in this war uh 25 percent cologne and denmark are doing the heavy lifting i'm fine with that so i might just take more provinces instead of other stuff we'll see about that but i guess i'm gonna end it here thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed the episode please leave a like if you didn't tell me why in the comments so i can improve and if you want to see more of this series in the future please consider subscribing to the channel i hope you join me next time thanks and bye bye